spoiler alert if you haven't seen Star Wars The Force Awakens. Okay, you had your chance. Disney recently released a video from Star Wars Collectibles that shows a step-by-step -step glimpse into how Darth Vader's melted helmet made the transition from the sketch pad and into the personal collections of 500 deep-pocketed fans. Designers created a replica prop that is virtually identical to the one in Kylo Ren's collection. I mean, I'm certainly one for family nostalgia, but I draw the line at biomedical devices. Oh, and, uh, and preserved skin tattoos. Oh, it's just... That is just dead people's skin. That's your, that's your frame on a wall, your walls, skin. A CAD file is created as the prop is scanned with a 3D scanning arm to create a digital model. According to the makers, the original prop was actually used to create the replicas. The model is cleaned up and then sent to a 3D printer which builds the replica using what appears to be a laser sintering process. The late Vader's headgear is removed from the build bed, cleaned up and cured as part of the post-processing before it's painted. The piece weighs 2.4 pounds and is about 16 by 12 inches in size. The pieces are available from Prop Shop, but they're gonna cost diehard fans $3,500 each. But get your orders in quick, the company says it's only going to print a limited edition run of 500 units. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to, I have to go and get an advance on my next check. Two advances. I'm David Manti. This is IEN Now. You want... That's as close as I'm ever getting to that mask. That's it. All right. <laughs>